it, it certainly was not my intention for that to be understood as as critics have tried to paint it as as somehow diminishing uh, the, the 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 suffering and hardship other Texans had experienced. Uh, look. Texans want this problem solved. I want this problem solved. I want the power on. We've, we've got most of the, the homes that had lost power have gotten power back. That's a good first step. We still have uh, water supply is still questionable in a lot of places, and that's frustrating. Having boil notices, that's frustrating too. We, we need to, the first thing we need to do is correct the immediate problem. And then the second thing we need to do is engage in the longer term examination. As I said, that the, the operation and regulation of that is at, at the state level and not the federal level. But I think those questions, Texans want answers. And, and I'm glad the governor is calling for the legislature to investigate that because I think that that is an investigation that needs to happen. Last question. Sure. Senator Cruz, Senator Cruz, did you, a lot of people are calling your decision to go to King Peter at this time, tell them that? Did you come back? Because you felt guilty, or did you come back because you got caught and there was a lot of backlash when you wrote me? So, so the question from the video on the cell phone was was whether the decision uh, to go was tone deaf. Look, it, it was obviously a mistake, and in hindsight, I, I wouldn't have done it. Um, I was trying to be a dad, and and all of us have made decisions. When you've got two girls who've been cold for two two days and haven't had heater power, and they're saying, "Hey, look, we don't have school. Why don't we go? Let's get out of here." I, I think there are a lot of parents that'd be like, "All right, let me. If I can do this, great. That's what I wanted to do." Um, as I said, really from. The moment I sat on the plane, I, I, I began really second guessing that decision and saying, "Look, I, I know why we're doing this, but but I've also got responsibilities, and and, and it had been my intention uh, to be able to to work remotely, to be on the phone, to be on internet, to be on Zoom, to be engaged, but." I needed to be here, and, and, and that's why I came back. And then as it became a bigger and bigger firestorm, uh, it became all the more compelling uh, that I needed to come back because our priority should be fixing this problem and making sure it doesn't happen again. And, and I didn't want all the screaming and yelling uh, about this trip to distract even one moment from the real issues that I think Texans care about, which is which is keeping all of our families safe. Okay, thank you all. Thank you, guys. Thank you.